Hey, this is Cool Trains of Montreal, and I'm here at the St. Patrick Street Bridge. And it looks like I got a freight coming over the bridge here at uh, Point St. Charles. It's on the other side, it's on the wrong side. I was just over there. Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me someone was a douche. You don't have to tell me, I'm sure they were. Somebody's trying to cross at that crossing in a wrong spot. And it's on the other side, so if a Via train comes, it will be on this side. So I could get a, theoretically, a two for one here. And it would be a, a pretty decent, although the sun came back out. bike path that also used to be a railroad track yeah, it looks like the sun went in which is good So it's April uh, 27th today, at about 2.30 p.m. I'm headed out to uh, the Peel Basin, see if I can get some of those uh, REM trains in testing. They're not expected to be uh, in service before probably June or July, I would imagine. They keep promising spring. Spring is here. but. No. Oh, look at that. Transformer loads, a couple of them. Yeah, those high and uh, wide loads. This is the side of the bridge I'm almost never on. I'm usually on the other side because of the sun. And I really think that's a cool cross beam there. That pier, very interesting, kind of a W. It's not the usual structural steel type pier. In fact, it might be concrete. Yeah, I think it's concrete, yeah. That's a concrete pier. The 
the end of the train. No black cars. Just empty flight cars. And I can't see them, unfortunately. Not much to see. Empty flight cars. Oh, there's some train. And auto racks. Look at that. Some kind of weird abstract art on there. These all should be empties, they're headed back east, headed back west rather, probably headed back towards Oshawa where the car plants are. It looks like it might be the end. Yep, that's the end of the train. So if you like what I do, please subscribe to Cool Trains in Montreal. Have a good day.